Back on the State Farm postgame, Jim Harbaugh making his home debut for Michigan, taking on a familiar face for Big Ten fans, Gary Anderson, who, of course, left Wisconsin now at Oregon State. And Gary Anderson's crew got off to a good start. Seth Collins to Hunter Jarman. And Oregon State on top, 7 to nothing. Wolverines defense really played well in this one. Joe Bolden coming up with the fumble recovery would lead to a field goal. They held Oregon State to 138 yards. How about two yards total in the last three quarters for Oregon State in this game? It's Davion Smith from Jake Rudock down inside the 10 to the 8. And from there it is Smith taking it in. He had three touchdowns in this game. Davion Smith did, ran for 126 yards, which was a career high, 17-7 at the half. Smith again, as Michigan gets the win, 35-7, the first of the Jim Harbaugh era. Afterwards, Sue Ann with the winners. All right, thanks a lot, guys, here with Davion Smith, who was the star for the Wolverines today, accounting for three of the four touchdowns. How were you able to be so successful today? Uh, the game plan, you know, I, I had to make a statement this week because last week I, did, I put uh, some film on the – out there for every, every team to watch, and I wanted to make a statement that that's not the type of running back I am. Coach had talked about, you know, he wanted this team to play faster, play smarter, maybe not think so much. Did you feel like all of you did that this week? They told us to just pay free. Don't worry about making a mistake. If you make a mistake, move on. Here with Chris Wormley, and wow, congratulations on your first win. How does this feel? Uh, it's great to get a win at home. You know, it's our first win of the season, and uh, you know we're feeling real good going into you know UNLV next week. Now you had another great game. Good game last week at Utah. You come up with a huge sack down here. Why were you able to be so successful for a second week in a row? Uh, I think it's just the preparation that we have. You know, with Coach Durkin putting in a good game plan all week. Um, you know, the D line helps out a lot. When you know, when they have three guys on one person in the middle, it kind of you know eases it up for someone else on the outside to get a second and it'll be productive.